what is going on guys welcome back to run my crypto hopefully you guys are doing well today today i got a great video for you guys but before i get into it obviously i'm going to go ahead and talk to you guys because i enjoy talking to you and letting you guys know that <clears throat> it's extremely urgent to get into crypto right now if you're going to take the path of investing in crypto why do i say that why do i say it's so important now because the problem is if you guys have seen the bull run in the previous uh past you understand that once that bull run goes into effect there's no turning back <clears throat> that means you're going to either jump in and jump in too late and you're going to miss all the buying opportunities that you guys have now so i urge you you only have roughly about nine months to build a portfolio to make yourselves uh or to put yourselves in a position to be able to invest prior to this next uh bull run and so with that in mind understand what you're investing in understand there's different strategies to get in if you don't have a lump sum of money to put in now you could obviously do the dollar cost average method or just basically put in whatever you can whenever you can but do it consistently for the next nine months put yourself in position to ride the bull run wave don't ride the bull run wave down you want to ride the bull wave run up so put yourself in position to make that happen and i'm here to kind of show you give you an idea definitely not financial advice but let's get into xrp as i believe will be one of the top projects for 2025 bull run all right guys if you guys like this make sure you hit that hit that like button smash that subscribe button and if you want to see more videos like this you know what to do Bing! hit that bell notification guys all right let's get into it X R P Ripple X R P Ripple X R P Ripple. <laughs> what is up, guys? Let's talk about Rip X R P. <laughs> My bad, had to throw that video in there. Let's talk about X R P today. Uh, so X R P is one of the major catalysts because of everything that's going on within X R P and the X R P Ledger. They have already started to scale out significantly, right? Besides uh, using the Fed now as a uh, uh some some type of test uh test net they're going they're basically using ripple and other companies to see how that's going to perform or is it possible or tons of stuff going on anyways we won the sec lawsuit sec still trying to fire back with an appeal or they're talking about it but it still has to go through their chamber they have to sit down they got to discuss is it even worth it who knows this may take many years not going to impact the united states and ripple as they've already launched on coinbase um binance um well, i believe kraken some other united states exchanges xrp now sitting on there um not only that <clears throat> super bullish information from them they picked up a uh stable coin that uh, uh a company built on their ledger from the pacific islanders i believe it's powell i'll go ahead and look at we'll go check out the website or not the website but we'll check out some news on that so a lot of stuff going on with ripple their metaverse they actually put a, a fund aside for their metaverse they put a fund aside for uh xrp uh nfts uh but they're taking the nfts to the next level what i mean by that they're not designing your little joe blow uh cartoon characters or you know color art they're basically trying to transform physical product into an nft super crazy guys what i'm saying is there are nft receipts that are being built so one thing that i could think of personally what that may entail is roughly the bill of sale of a home the bill of sale of a car uh concert tickets uh anything that is uh you know uh able to be receded is going to be an nft so like say a pink slip to your car i believe that the route they're trying to go is turning that pink slip to your car with a contract address that gives you the ability to hold your receipt to your vehicle the bill of sale to your home amongst them, many other things as an nft so getting crazy guys getting super crazy but this is why i'm super bullish in crypto and web3 because this is where we're moving into guys this is the new space this is why i believe in these specific uh sectors of cryptocurrency and you should too all right guys let's get into the charts xrp x r p ripple
all right guys looking at xrp on the daily we are still sitting at 71 cents this was actually sitting at 71 cents yesterday which is uh pretty amazing so it's holding still we're seeing some sideways consolidation with xrp looking at their market cap is sitting at 37 billion 715 million dollars i won't say the rest because it changes like every second so uh volume coming in is one billion dollars for the 24 hour which is super bullish that's a lot of money to be flowing into xrp um especially uh, given that the markets are kind of stagnant or kind of sideways consolidating right now which leads me to believe that xrp is sitting in a very very good state all right circulating supply is 52 billion xrp tokens out there that people decided to put in their wallets their ledgers their cold storage their trust wallets their metamask etc all right <clears throat> so total supply is 100 billion xrp so that means that 52 percent of xrp is already sold 52 percent guys think about that that means there's only about 50 percent left all right so imagine when big institutions come in and start buying that 50 50 percent is going to be diluted sucked up dried out it's going to be a dry county for xrp and these decimal points is going to pump over to the right <clears throat> sorry about that guys throat's a little dry it's a little hot today out here in southern california but you know what it is all right so looking at the charts we're going to go ahead and look at the daily so if you see on the daily again with that 71 cent level we just kind of been hovering down we've seen a spike to 72 72 cents and then back down to 71 cents so we kind of been in this consolidation pattern that means it's a sideways pattern some key points that i want you guys to look at is that we have to find um we have to understand where our levels of supports are so let's go to the year so now within the within this specific year we've seen xrp from 30 some cents consolidate and this is all because of this uh, sec battle with xrp um whole 2022 did not go within that range however the positive of this is that people were still believing in the project we had pumps we had people buy and hold like you know for example you know the the total the uh circulating supply could have been at 30 percent then collected a 40 percent <clears throat> then sold off five percent then it's at 35 percent and then back to your 40 percent and then boom 50 percent of the total supply consumed when judge annalisa torres uh gave ruling to xrp which it's super huge right <clears throat> so people don't understand is it over no potentially it could may it may not be but it is for now guys so if the sec does decides to say hey we want to appeal your ruling what's going to happen it's going to go through first the sec has to sit down amongst their their table and decide hey we're going to go ahead and uh uh appeal this so that could take however long it's going to take then they got to get it into the court systems then they got to go ahead and you know work all their details out then they're going to pick judges it's just it's going to take multiple years guys by then we'll already see the next bull run um so here's the important information guys for this next bull run where do we think xrp is going to go so coming out the gate xrp went from five zero point zero zero five to a three dollar three dollar target out of nowhere guys <clears throat> in 2018 um, again there was a lot of catalysts uh that were that were pushing this narrative of decentralized finance but it wasn't as big as it is now today see at the time that we seen this first bull run <clears throat> back in 2018 there was no fed now there was no uh, uh d5 projects that were building on the same thing there may have been but it, they, there was just really no use for it but now that not only the united states but they're fed now japan banks australian banks uk banks um african banks i mean if you guys know it looks like russia just forgave africa for their uh couple 20 billion uh debt that they had to them because that means something's cooking up guys there's something cooking up in the background and we're losing sight that they're trying to go away from whatever systems we are have in place now so understand that cryptocurrency is going to be used worldwide globally and it's going to be the global currency i'm just starting to see that more and more as i 
dig in and I do my analytics and I look at to analyze the way the projects are going, what the economy is looking at, you know, looking like across the globe. You cannot only focus in on the economy where you live. You must, must look at other economies and ecosystems that are out there. Okay. Very important news. So where do I think XRP will go? Uh, 2025. I'm actually going to give it a $10 mark. Okay. So as I mentioned to you, as money flows in, I'm thinking this decimal point is going to move over one space and that'll put us at $7.15. So I think the ultimate high would be roughly around $10.12, $10.15. That's where I think XRP will go in the next bull run based on the amount of money that's going to flow into crypto with Bitcoin ETFs, with FedNow, with whatever the BRICS nations got going on. <laughs> you know, it's sad to say, but we have to change uh there you know people don't like to accept change change is good i know it sucks it hurts i've always told people that the biggest part of change is fear and once you get beyond that fear there you become complacent with what going what's going on so you have to learn how to manage that fear cut it down adopt right away because if not you're gonna have to get through that fear level feel comfortable when enough people convince you that that change is good by that time people are already way five more steps ahead of you so very very important information to understand when investing in crypto why you want to invest in crypto so many other narratives in crypto i believe that every space has its value but you have to start you have to you have to start somewhere and i believe the decentralized finance is the start of the new age crypto new age web 3 so super bullish on xrp hbar quant all these projects ada um, ethereum bitcoin these are the main catalysts for cryptocurrency that are going to set the stage set the precedence for all these other crypto projects ai is going to be strong um and whatever else they come out with because elon musk is pushing dogecoin so there's a lot of stuff going on with crypto yes you can make tons of money but stay in your lane play the game right build from the bottom up you can't build a castle in, in one day you have to start with the ground level understand what that is and as times move on you invest in those projects that are going to start to build web 3 build ai and build the crypto space all right guys this is a short one hopefully you guys got something out of this xrp we're going to the top i don't care who says yes or no doesn't matter there's haters out there but I'll tell you what, I'm going to laugh my ass all the way to the bank, guys. All right, stay blessed. Run my crypto. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. See more content like this. Take care, guys. Be blessed. Happy Sunday.